nemesis, Larry Zonka, legend, dolphin icon, honk for Zonk. It was a rallying cry when people were protesting the dolphins down here before the uh, before the season. Honk for Zonk. Honk for him. Honk for him. Zonk is in Alaska. I don't think. Did you hear any of the honking going on down here for you, Larry? I don't hear much honking at all in Alaska, to be honest with you, unless we're downtown Anchorage. That's uh, you know, there's only a million people in this state. Three hundred thousand of them are in the city of Anchorage, and uh, I tend to stay away from there quite a bit. I'm a little further north up in the mountains, so I haven't heard much honking at all. No. You like living out there because it's out there. <laughs> Larry, you uh, you kind of left football. You left Miami, and you went about as far as geographically possible as you can while remaining, you know, tied somehow to the United States. Well, then that's true. You know, as for today, it took me ten years or so. It was always a dream of mine, even back in the early days when Coach Hula first arrived there. We talked about it several times. He was fascinated that I was fascinated with Alaska, but. I've always, you know, it's been a childhood dream since I was probably eight or nine years old to get up here. I like the mountains. I like the outback. Uh, the more remote, the better. I like wildlife and like the scenery. It wasn't a thing to get away from anything. It was coming to something. So how does that work, Larry? When you leave, uh, you leave the front porch in the morning. Uh, are you going out there looking for uh, for animals to kill? Uh, <laughs> no, Dan. I'm not going off my front porch looking to kill anything. I. Uh, <laughs> I hunt uh, for some meat once in a while, but uh, most of the, the activities I have in the wild are enjoying it and fishing. And, uh, we don't even keep all the fish we catch, uh, so it's not necessarily a uh, pioneer existence. We do uh, fill our freezer, usually between caribou or moose or a combination of the two. And how often do you hunt? Larry Zonka, have a favorite hunting story? <laughs> We have with the 
cantankerous Larry Zonka. He behaves exactly the way that I want my old fullback <laughs> to behave. My favorite sentence in that interview is, I'm sorry I disappointed you. On the other hand, go screw yourself. <laughs>